your abundance mindset will come to you when you're set up. When you have your place, bro, you can scroll through your phone, close your eyes, pick number 27. Bro, yeah, what are you doing? Yeah, come over if you want. Yeah, yeah, I'm serious. Let's go. Wear something nice. When you can do that, bro, <coughs> casually, that's the level you want to be at. What's up, boys? Welcome back to the channel. You've seen the title. One of the coldest advices I can give you, I'm going to talk about in today's video. Roll the credits, Bruce. We are ha. Ah. What's up, boys? You've seen the title. As you come in, make sure to like the video, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything. Drop it on the Meister Methods YouTube channel. As always, this channel is dedicated to helping normal guys understand all the elements when it comes to dating and relationships with women. I give you actionable and practical advice so that you can be the best versions of yourself when it comes to dating and talking to women. Now, this video is actually about the men. No homo. Bro, are you set up? Are you set up as a man? When I'm talking about set up, I mean, have you got your own place? Or are you still living at home? When you get your own place, everything becomes easier you don't have to listen to rules from your parents you can do what you want you can invite bitches to your house females and then you can kick them out and then bring in a replacement if they don't want to do what you want to do it's that simple you save money because you don't have to go to restaurants bro you can eat what you want because you can cook so if you do meal prep she's going to eat your food bro or she's going to bring her food or she's going to cook for you when you have your own place, things become easier. This video is really for older guys. I think if you're in school and college and university, then obviously concentrate on your academics. But for the older guys, like say 23, 24 and above, bro, you need to understand that you shouldn't really be talking to females if you haven't got, if you're not set up. If you haven't got your own place, you shouldn't be dating. If you haven't got a steady job, you shouldn't even be talking to females. And this is also what pisses me off as well. I'll get 30, 40 DMs a day. I'll get a lot of, I'll get 40 to 50 DMs, probably a daily. And most of them is, bro, I'm dating this girl. Um, I need your advice, bro, what do you think about this? Text message, read it, what do you think, bro? Like I'm a charity, hmm? 95% of these guys don't subscribe to my YouTube channel. They don't support me. I don't see them in the I don't see them in the in the comments. I don't see them liking my videos. But yeah, everyone feels free. I'm not a charity boys. I give you free advice on YouTube and all my videos. But when you DM me, it upsets me. It annoys me sometimes. It annoys me. And I'm not trying to get emotional, I'm not trying to get vaginal. When I say sign up to my membership, which is $20 a month, you guys can't support it. But you feel free to ask me all the questions in the world. But you're the same rookies, the same soy boys that have got girlfriends, that are going out on dates, that are struggling week in, week out. Invest in yourselves so that you don't have to keep making mistakes. $20 a month. Match, you can ask me anything for 30 days of the year. Quick phone calls. Or you can go on dates, which will cost you 40 minimum, I would say. Double for a day, and you're not digging guts. Doesn't make sense, man. Mate, stop DMing me. Pissing me off. Purpose over girls. All day, every day. You come first, you are the man. Prioritize yourself, prioritize your future, make investments, start a business, get your own place, work hard, get enough money, legitly, to get your own place. Once you get your own place, then you can start bringing in the girls. But it shouldn't be bringing in the girls, no place, and getting it wrong. When you have your own place, you'll find your own style. Hmm? 
you'll find your own style you'll find what works for you you'll get your own philosophy you'll know what candles to put out you know what movies to put on that you've seen a hundred times you will get your style you'll get your philosophy and you'll get a bulletproof system until you've got until you're not set up bro keep working hard keep pushing girls away talk to them but don't it doesn't make sense to me to understand that she doesn't make your life better you make her life better you are the prize not her prioritizing women is beta prioritizing yourself is alpha put it this way if all you have to offer her is a date then you're beta hmm? think of that if all you have to offer her is a date then why does she want it? why should she be with you and I'm not saying trick but think of it logically if all you have to offer her is a date and no other value why should she choose you ask yourself women like men because of the world they can enter she wants to be part of your world she does not want to be the center of it when you just prioritize women you're making them the center of your world when you have everything around you that's what attracts her to you you also need to understand boys that your abundance mindset will come to you when you're set up when you have your place bro you can scroll through your phone close your eyes pick number 27 bro yeah what are you doing yeah come over if you want yeah yeah i'm serious let's go wear something nice when you can do that bro <coughs> casually that's the level you want to be at yeah you need to raise your smv once you raise your smv your life will become better you raise your sexual market value by being able to to stunt have you clocked well, maybe you haven't but i noticed these things no homo a lot of the guys that take pictures it's always the same pictures isn't it i pose in the lift pose in my kitchen pose like i'm pretending to cook but all it does is it demonstrates higher value females see attractive guys but they also process ah he's got his own place this is the key boys try and follow some male influencers just see how they act how, see how they move no homo you're doing it so that you can better yourself remember getting females on dating apps is easy i've shown you that on tinder maybe one day i'll do one on hinge as well but the point i'm trying to make is getting girls on apps is easy getting your own place initially is hard do the hard work first so that everything else can become easier imagine how many times you have to think of dates unless you're good enough and you just have a go-to spot that the people that work there they know who you are already but they act they help you out mm, i've been there i know <sighs> triple book double book i've told the story many times on instagram but the point i'm trying to make please is set yourself up and play your role as a man when you set yourself up, everything else will be much easier for you. Listen up. If you are serious about women, you need to get your own everything. Own your shit. When you own your shit, you will dominate, bro. You will dominate everything. I'll leave you with this, boys. If you invite her over and she doesn't want to smash, she doesn't want to, you know, she doesn't want to, she doesn't want to dig the guts, bro. She knows that next time she comes to your house, she's gonna dig the guts. Yeah, nothing more, nothing less. She comes over, you can kick her out. She comes over, you can chill, you can vibe. But what she does know, the second time she comes over, you're definitely digging guts, 100%. And when you get your own place, bro, it's easier to build rotations. Easier. I see two a week, hmm? Two a week. Spread them out. Three a week if I want to. Four a week if she wants to watch me play Xbox. Think about it. You will find your style. You will find your philosophy. Do what you need to do. Fix yourself first before you start blowing backs up. Knocking their man calls loose. <laughs> See you in the next one, boys. Keep learning, keep grinding, keep leveling up. Peace.